Right, so guys, I am bringing you the what is my what's my light level mod for 1.3.1. 1. Uh, this is the seventh mod in my series. Uh, the playlist will be in the description, so click on that, and you'll find all the mods I have done so far. The uh, two annotations of, of what are on screen will be the custom block selector and the wall changer mod. So pretty much what this mod does is uh, if you press F4. If you look in the top or top left of the screen where the delete bit is there you will see there is like a little thing that says light level um, it, it changes so uh, you can show your seed your coordinates your biome your light level indicators like to say if there's if there's animals around here uh, if things are growing uh, and like creepers and slimes and that like no like mobs and stuff if the light levels too lower uh, you get the uh, FPS and your chunk updates which way you're facing your little compass and that's it uh, you get options here and I'm actually gonna reset the default because this is where on a I had it different last time because it didn't have images on but you get all the options so you can have debug on and off so you get all this bit down here uh, I would have it off. You can have a cycle key, so you can set it to whatever you want. So I can have it to uh, Y. I preferably have a default of F4. Your time format, you can have as 12, 24 hour, or you can have it off. Images on and off. So the images, like of the little, there you go. The torch, or it just says light level. Uh, I preferably would say have them off. I think. Just let me see what that does. Yeah, there you go. I would preferably have them off. Because then it shows you, you can have mobs growing, uh, where mobs are, there's crops growing, uh, and that says, that says they're not growing, but the animals and trees, that means there are animals and there are trees around here in this little biome bit. So that, I would, that helps quite a bit. Or it said they're growing because the, I've got grass, but it says there's no grass. Okay, well, I'm not too sure about that one. But, yeah, uh, you get all the options, so... Uh, you can have enabled in this world, so you can just have it to not even work on this world or whatever. Uh, you can change the position, so it's now gone to there, uh, there, and there. Uh, you can change the colours of it, like the text and stuff. I would preferably keep it as white or have it as a light colour. Let me be like a lime green, because that works, but that also contrasts with that. Or a light blue, that looks quite nice. Uh, you can have override F3, so if you press F3, that'll disappear. The seed with coordinates, there we go. Uh, the seed apparently is zero at the minute. So I'm not too sure about that. And this is where you can just, this is where you can change it. This is, uh, without pressing F4, you can just cycle through it like that. The enabled outputs, uh, you can have whichever one you want on, at whichever time. So you can have just FPS on, or, and then... That and then if you have just FPS off, it'll never just show you th your your FPS. So that that's kind of good if you don't want it. Your light level options, uh, I don't get that at the minute. I'm not too sure. I think it's for coloring and stuff. And the enter seed for this level, if you know the seed for the level, so say if you have it as like four five six, and you could put four five six save seed, and that'll say the seeds that. And then, like, that'll help you for finding slimes, as it says here. You're going to hit this will be both the seed display and allow slime chunk detection. So, if you put, like, a certain number in, so say if you get a seed off the internet, and it's something like, uh, 5, 6, 8, 4, or whatever, you can put that in there, and then that can, uh, show you, like where the slime chunks are and stuff so a very worthwhile mod if you would like to download this mod it is in the description i would recommend downloading it because it is very helpful so yeah guys thank you for watching this and i'll see you in the next one bye bye